35, 25, long pass to Chambers and behind the back. Did you ever think in your wildest dreams that I guess it was? KJ to Chambers, damn! 40 points in the first half for Tom Chambers. Chambers with 60 points. Chambers to win the game. He's got it. Welcome back to Tom Chambers' Greatest Games. In this episode, we go way back to February 1984 with the Seattle Supersonics playing the Denver Nuggets. With Chambers having been traded to the Sonics for the 1983-84 season, he would face a tough transition fitting into a veteran lineup of All-Stars playing a slower tempo game. In what would be his big breakout game for the Sonics, Chambers would score a season-high 34 points against the Nuggets, including hitting 12 consecutive field goals and finishing the game going 15 for 18 from the field in a 12-point win. So let's go back to February 19, 1984, the Seattle Supersonics versus the Denver Nuggets at the Kingdom. David Wagner, 35-21 on 116th Marysville, Washington. David Wagner's guess is the first three-point shot will be made, and the shooting team square for the shot will be even. Today's prize money, $1,000. The Nuggets get the basket on the tip-off, and they get it right in under to Richard Anderson. He makes the first shot, and the Nuggets are out on top of the Sonics here, 2-0. And that's something they did not do a week ago. Tuesday, it brings it in to Gus Williams, comes out to the left side to meet the ball, goes to Chambers, top of the key. Takes left, drives right, a little running jump shot, bangs in from eight feet, score tied at two. So Chambers gets the first two for the Sonic. Rob Williams brings it down, fires to Dunn off towards the right corner. Tom gets it up to Gus Williams, up the left side goes Gus, makes a move, goes inside, fires it back to Chambers. Chambers comes along the baseline, layup shot goes, and a foul is called on the play. It's going on the baseline. A foul is called, a pushing foul is charged against Alex English. So Chambers has a chance to make it a three-point play. Nuggets are at the limit of 14 fouls. Seattle has not committed a foul as yet, or at least if they have, they haven't been caught at it. So Chambers, who has picked up four points, goes to the free throw line with a chance to give Seattle its biggest lead. He does as the free throw goes down. Sonics are out on top by five. Dishes uh, left to Wood, fires a 15-footer, gets caught in under. Chambers lays it up and in. Nice play by Tom Chambers on Wood's short shot. From 12, it is no good. Rebound Hawes, outlet pass, but the... Sonic, oh, wait a minute, Gus puts up a shot. It hit the backboard. It put a count and it is gone. So we'll have to count Gus Williams as a three-point shot attempt because up uh, went Earl Strom's hand, and it would have counted had it gone. He hit the backboard, but that was it. End of the first quarter, Sonic's lead in a high-scoring game, which is normal against the Denver Nuggets. It's Seattle 38 and the Denver Nuggets 36. Gus with the ball working out high on the three-point line. Top of the key right side, Chambers who swings it to Brown down towards the corner. Bounce pass to Chambers, turns. Little left-handed scoop shot is good. Chambers just kind of shovel that one up. Pops it in, and the Sonics are back in a tie at 41. But over 50% here is faked by Chambers. It drives and slams up. He drove on his band like he wasn't even there. 52-49 Seattle, and Chambers now with 11 points for the afternoon. Sunbull left side, down low. Chambers backs in, gets double team. Back to the corner, Sunbull. Back down low, Chambers turns to the baseline. Fires 12-footer. Good. Nice move by Chambers. Good shot to put the Sonics back out on top by one at 56-55. Sunbolt out on the left side looking for Chambers. Gets it to him. Goes in under reverse layup. It goes in. Will count and he got fouled. Nice play by Champ. And just when Chambers gets that ball within 15 feet of the basket, he makes some excellent moves. He has some of the best speed for a big man and his coach Lenny Wilkins has said that too. Foul in the play was charged against Richard Anderson, his second. So the Sonics are back in the lead and a chance now to make it a two-point Advantage if Chambers can put in the free throw. He missed two earlier, makes this one. So Chambers is two for four at the line. Now Chambers has nine points in this quarter, 16 for the afternoon. Nugget. Lead. Reggie King, top of the key, passes left to Wood down low. Chambers, overplay by Anderson, knocked the ball away. Chambers gets it back. Take the pass, comes in, puts up an eight-footer on the run. Good. Teddy Chambers really shoots well on the move. 11 points in this period. He has put in his last five in a row. Sunbold inside the three-point line, down low to Chambers. Back to Sunbold, little fake, comes around, backs away. 
Down low now to Chambers, goes inside, layup, good, and a foul call on the play. Again, Seattle having a great ability at getting the ball. Chambers really overmatches Anthony Roberts, the guy who's playing him. Roberts has a forward, is only 6'5", and Chambers at 6'11". So Seattle is taking advantage of that mismatch. English gets the foul. Chambers has put in his last six in a row. Chambers now with 21 points for the afternoon. 22 points. 20 points. Now it's 21. Free throw goes in. 21 points. I was counting ahead. And the Sonics at the halftime lead the Denver Nuggets 70 to, rather, it's Seattle 75 and the Denver Nuggets 70. If you don't drink this, my bill, honey, you ain't got to take. Gus out to Chambers, top of the key. Chambers drive inside the foul line, puts up a short one from 12 feet, drops it, and Chambers is up to 26 points for the afternoon. 85-82. Sonics in front court. Reggie King, left side. Fakes, comes in. Pass in on a little pick and roll, and it's good. Uh, shot by Tom Chambers. Chambers, by the way, is at 2, 4, 6, 8, his last nine in a row. We're going to have to keep watch on the Sonic consecutive record of 13 held by Lonnie Shelton. Gus up the middle, goes in, feed out to Chambers. Chambers inside, puts up a left-handed jump hook that is good. And now the Sonics are out on top at 89 to 82. And the Nuggets one timeout with 5.14 to play in the first half. And Chambers just having a fantastic game is up to 30 points. And the Sonics lead Denver 89 to 82. Chambers with the ball top of the key. Roberts has 12 points for the afternoon. Chambers over to uh, King. Chambers gets it back, fires an 18-footer that is good. And Tom Chambers now 11 in a row. Six in the second quarter, five in this period. We're down a minute to go, third quarter. Hawes, pass left side, Chambers. Chambers leans into a short, but he pops it in, and he is up to 12 in a row. He is just one shy of tying the Sonic and second field goal mark. Evans. Ball comes into Chambers. He fires a long one from backcourt. At the quarter. So they're going to call that a shot. If they do, that ends his string of 12. Are they going to count it? He just threw the ball, and it's too bad he threw it because that broke a string of 12 consecutive field goals. Had somebody else thrown that ball down court instead of Chambers, he would have still had it going. Well, at the end of the third quarter, the Sonics 105, the Nuggets 95. Both clubs cooling off a little bit in this period. One for three Sonics, one for six Denver. Freddie Brown from downtown. Left corner pops it in. It didn't go cleanly. Reigns came in for King. Brown right side. Dribbles in, pulls up a little jumper from 12, pops it down, and Freddie Brown's having himself a fine afternoon. 11 points, and Sigma setting up down low. Brown trying to fight away from Evans. An overplay by Evans. Brown gets a turnaround foul line jumper. is good. 116-102, a pass up court to Evans. Sunbull pass down low to Sigma. Turn, fires a 13-footer. Baseline, good. Beats to Brown, top of the key. Evans right on him. Brown goes inside, puts up a little shovel hook shot on the run. It is good. He got fouled. I don't think it was by Evans. I think it was by another guy who picked him up. Evans down, feeds over to Williams. Top of the key, English. Swings the left. This will fire from 21. Good. 123 to 110, and we still have 454 to play. Jack gets a nice hand. He comes to the bench with 21 points. Tom Chambers had 34 points after three quarters today. We thought he might go for his career high of 39. Outlet pass to Mike Evans. Pumps in, feeds off English, gets an easy layup, but he blew it. Then he puts it in from the opposite side, and he made it. You blow one, you make one, and he's all even up with himself there. It's probably going to be your final score. Ball's tipped over to Brown, tips it to Hayes. That's the end of the game. Final score, Seattle 132 and Denver 120.